Welcome back to Tashkid FX for another price prediction update and in this video I'll be giving you a price prediction update on Gala Games whose current price stands at the 0.0272 dollar mark and here on trading view the market is down by 1.27% and in this video I want to give you the key scenarios that I expect to play out basing my analysis on the ADO2 structures the Fibonacci and also the key areas of support and resistances and now kick start my analysis here on the daily chart giving you the wider view that is the long long term scenarios that can play out here on the Gala Games chart and from what you can see here on the charts from these low prices that we had been trading within we saw a very nice bounce to the upper side which had been obeying the edu 12 structures in this impulsive movement taking us to a no time high and having seen that movement to the upper side we can term that as a first wave to the upper side here on the daily chart then after seeing the all time high we have been seeing this massive ABC corrective movement which has now taken us back to around the $0.02 dollar mark and because a wave 2 is what we expect after seeing the formation of a higher ADO 12 count 1 and we have seen an ABC corrective movement then we can term this as a higher ADO 12 count 2 and whatever we expect after seeing the formation of a higher ADO 12 count 2 is a movement to the upper side in the formation of a higher ADO 12 count 3 then a wave 4 and then continue pushing higher in a wave 5 and assuming that the bear market low is in in the formation of this higher edu 12 count 2 at around the 0.02 dollar mark then there are chances that we can sketch out a minimum target area to the upper side in the formation of a wave 3 using the trend based fibonacci connecting it from the low of the first wave down there to the high of the first wave then dragging the fibs to the low of the second wave and that gives me a minimum target area to the upper side at the FIB level 1.618 and that is at around the 1.36076 dollar mark that is the minimum that I can expect that bounce to the upper side in the formation of a wave 3 to do and that can only happen in case we see a bull movement in the whole crypto market and also an increase in volume here on the Gala Games chart so that is those are the keys that is the key scenario that can play out that is viewing it from the daily chart getting to the one hour chart so that we can get to the short term scenarios that can play out here on the one hour chart you can see after making our low at around the 0.02 four dollar mark we have been seeing a very nice bounce to the upper side in a movement that has been obeying the edu 12 structures and we can have these as the first wave to the upper side then whatever we have been seeing over here in this corrective movement is a, is the formation of a wave two then i'm expecting a wave three then a wave four and then continue pushing higher in the formation of a wave five and using the fibonacci we can get to see whether this wave two has done the minimum that we expect a wave two to the lower side to do by connecting the fibonacci from the low of the first wave down there to the high of the first wave and that gives me a minimum retracement area to the lower side in the formation of a wave 2 between the fib level 0.5 and the fib level 0.618 and i can mark that target area here on the charts and you can see we have retraced into that target area even lost the fib level 0.618 but lucky for us we have not yet lost the fib level 0.78 it's holding the fib level gala games is holding the fib level 0.78 and it seems like we are seeing a bit of a reversal to the upper side and that would mean maybe the low for this higher uh, this wave two over here might be in at around the 0.026 dollar mark and whatever we are seeing over here is a reversal to the upper side might be the movement that is forming this wave three to the upper side which i expect to be impulsive and also see fractal waves information within that wave three to the upper side but for now we don't have any confirmations whether this is a wave three to the upper side and it has also not shown any impulsive nature so for now we need to just be patient and see whether we are going to see a nice reversal which is impulsive and using this low that we have at around the 0.027 dollar mark we can sketch out a minimum target area to the upper side in the formation of this wave 3 by using the trend based fibonacci connecting it from the low of the first wave to the high of the wave one then dragging the fibs to the low of the second wave and that gives me a minimum target area to the upper side using the fib level 1.618 which perfectly lies at around the 0.0 four dollar mark and that is the minimum that i would expect gala games to do in that wave three to the upper side before we see a wave four and then continue pushing higher in a wave five also taking a look at the indicators here on the one hour chart to see what movements will be supported here on the one hour chart we are trading at around the 44 mark meaning we have massive room for us to support either movements to the either to the upper side on and, and also to the lower side and that means we have massive room for us to support any movements either to the upper side or to the lower side also taking a look at the 
the MACD here on the MACD we have printed a bearish cross and that would mean no prices are coming our way so let's be patient and see how that plays out because the bear market low might not be in and we might continue pushing lower making a new low here on the gala games chart that is still a possibility so let's be patient and see how that plays out and i'll keep you updated